Another lovely morning. Are you joking? <laughs> too much on me anyways every time i start vlogging again i'm like was i built for this i am i promise i'll be better at it because i have an editor shout out to my editor today i'm flying to phoenix for my friend's wedding and i'm in it so that's exciting but i need to finish packing i packed actually i just feel like i need to take some things out because i might be over 50 pounds i'm a chronic overpacker i don't know what to tell you i i'm never gonna underpack and one time one time I did pack, I guess like a normal person, probably still packed over, and I didn't have enough options and I regretted it, so maybe I will keep my bag. Um, I still need to do my nails and a few other things. These are things that you should probably not leave for the day that you're leaving, but it is what it is. So I'm gonna shower, get ready, pack, have breakfast, all that good stuff before heading to the airport. figured out what I'm gonna do about my bags I'm overpacking I just wanted to do the big bag and a duffel but I just that's not gonna happen so I'm gonna do a carry-on and a tote bag as well so call me an overpacker for my nails I was debating on just painting them with like regular gel it's the hard gel it's not hard gel it's the SC gel that you don't need a UV light for you know what I'm saying or doing like my own acrylics or doing press-ons and I'm doing press-ons because girl I don't have time but I use Impress Nails? No. Am I okay? This is literally all of in June. Um, they're wonderful. They are so hard to take off, actually. I had to take them off once because I was doing a campaign for them. Impossible, which is great. Unless you're doing a campaign and you need to swap them out. Um, so I'm gonna do some French tip nails, have some breakfast, and catch an Uber to the airport. to edit, hair to fix, um, then I land in Arizona, no plans for this evening, but tomorrow we hit the ground running, in the morning we have rehearsal, which I've never done a morning rehearsal before, and then um, we have a lunch, and then some cool time, hang out time with everyone, can y'all pipe down, I'm, I'm filming, uh, and then we have after that cocktail hour, and then Saturday's the wedding, so woo, that's all I got. to Arizona safe and sound actually let me show you the B&B as the sun sets the lights are turning on it's so cute out here are you joking I'm moving to warm weather but honestly just so happy to be in warm weather the flight went well I feel like um, the flight to Arizona and I was talking about this with my friend the bride and we were both saying how like the three and a half hour <laughs> flight mark um, always feels so much longer I was like just take me to London take me the other way I swear the six seven hour flight seven eight hour um, feel shorter, but 
just excited to be here, not doing too much tonight. She went out um, for dinner and I was like, I'm gonna stay back and do a few things, but I ordered some food for dinner and then my laptop died. So I was gonna twiddle my thumbs out here, but then I'm gonna shower, twiddle my thumbs inside and do all that good stuff. But the events and everything start tomorrow. So excited to get that going, but it's just like a travel day vlog, not too much going on, except someone tried to take my Uber, not on purpose, not on purpose. When I landed, um, these two men were in my Uber and her name was Dana. Obviously mine is Diana. I was like, did you not check the license plate? Girl, what happened to Stranger Danger? Safety. Anyways, it all worked out. I'm here. I'm excited. It's warm. Can't complain. So I'll see you tomorrow. Guys, good morning. It's so nice out. It's 60. Um, I'm gonna go for a run. Like, here's my outfit. Run outfit. Girl, where am I gonna stand you? Uh, my run outfit of the day today. I feel like you might be a little backlit. I do apologize. Check them out. Shorts are really lemon. Um, shirt, I think a lot of, almost all of my athletic gear is actually lemon. These I wanna say are the fast pitch speed up short. I'm gonna double check that, but um, they're my favorites because they're so flowy when running. And sunscreen, always. So I'll see you after my run. quick fit check for the rehearsal lunch and everything my dress is from Rixo bag is just odd and my shoes are low flow Randall but I don't think I'm gonna bring my cam to the rehearsal and lunch and everything so we're just gonna go there hang out come hang out by the pool after and then I have cocktail party tonight okay to start with obviously being in arizona and being in 98 degree weather it's actually not that bad right now um i want to say today was like 80 it's just been so glorious but i mixed the super goop spf um just like their tinted spf and my westman atelier drops and i really liked it because i just didn't want to do this alone but i also want spf in my routine um, and I have these drops as well. I need to get my mirror one second, girls. The SPF 50 in that is so nice. I also have like a spray um, sunscreen as well that I can bring kind of like a, a setting spray type sunscreen. Um, but it's nice because once you have makeup on, it's not like you're reapplying sunscreen on top of that unless it's a powder or a spray. So that's what I've been using. Do I have it with me? I know, I think it's in my bedroom. And I guess you could use a brush, but I just use my hands. I have the big brush from Say that I like to use. I don't, oh, actually, it might be in here. Um, this one. I really, really like using this one from Say. And I'd probably use it if I was just doing these drops, but I don't mind using my hands for application. And then, yeah, amazing. What to do next? I actually have not a clue. Um, what am I gonna do? Eyebrows? I guess we could start there. First things first. Okay, um, so first things first, I flew Delta here. Did I? I'm sorry, not Delta, United. And I'm not like a strong, I don't have, if I could speak words, that would be wonderful. I flew United getting here and I don't have a strong affiliation with like any airline. I thought I used to be like Southwest, but that, I think like I was in college because their flights were so cheap and that was great for me in college, especially. Um, but now after traveling a bunch, I feel like, I might be a United girl there. Every time I fly them, everything has just been wonderful. So if you have any like credit cards or cards or wherever you get like, your best points, let me know. I feel like I should be investing or looking into like a travel card that I should be using. I just haven't been using one. Eyebrows, I use NYX Brow Glue and then I use Kosas. I don't even know what this is called. What is this called? Oh, Airbrow. Reading the bottle would help. Um, so I use these two on my brows and that's really it. I think I'm going to do a pink eyeshadow today. Stand by. I've had this Tarte palette for... I don't know, four years. 
Last time I wore pink eyeshadow was to a Harry Styles concert, so there's that. When is he coming back on tour? The dress I'm wearing this evening is black, um, so pink should be fine. And the shoes that I'm gonna wear with it are probably purple, so those should also be fine. I've been using this body oil. I got it for this weekend because I wanted a travel size from Osea, Ose, Oshea. Girl, I don't know. It's fab. I really like it. Also, the smell of it is fantastic. Also, it's Malibu, made in Malibu, I'm pretty sure, and I'll be in Malibu. Speaking of, if you have any Malibu wrecks, please let me know. Oh, I'd love to do a brown liner. I'm gonna use my lip liner as an eyeliner. Is that legal? Girl, I don't know. Mm, I think it might be. Okay, blush my tried and true Westman Atelier in Bichette and Elf Putty Blush in the color Caribbean. Um, so earlier today we had, which is actually, I am so here for early rehearsals. Usually the rehearsals I've been to, one, um, they're in the evening, which I, I mean, it makes sense. Like you do rehearsal, then a rehearsal dinner. But I love that today we did rehearsal and then we went to a lunch after. Lunch was delicious. And I do like that it was like a Friday afternoon rehearsal, but I do understand that if you have out of town guests or something, if they're working during the day, obviously in the evening would work better for people. This lash sculpt from Rafai, I've been loving. I have to show you what I wore to the rehearsal. I wore this, I keep wanting to say Stott. I wore the Rixo. Sandrine dress with my brown stod bag and then I wore my loafers they loafers can I speak words my sandals um, are from loafler Randall and I got them last year and they're actually super super comfortable which I wasn't sure if they would be because they're flat but I walked around with them for like hours one time in Italy and they were totally fine by the end of the day I also love the earrings that I wore today they're from Hoyana which is J-O-I ANA, super lightweight because I could not wear heavy heavy earrings. Um, and they were fab. I want to wear them again later this week. I'm thinking I'm going to wear them tonight because I brought chunky silver ones that I want to wear this evening. But I do really like them. I'm also adding the YSL mascara on top of the um, Refi one just because I just don't want to keep putting this on my eyelashes and this is a bit chunkier and darker, I feel like. So. I don't know, it does the job faster. But it definitely clumps way more than the Refi one. And I'm gonna be in Malibu next week, so please give me your Malibu Rex, all of them, every single one. I have a list and I have some reservations and stuff already, and Malibu, Malibu, Malibu I think is small enough that I'll hit most of the places that people might recommend. Um, but I would love to know your favorite spots, to hang, to eat, to do anything. Huda Beauty, 2.0, no. Huda Beauty, Huda Beauty Lip Contour 2.0 in the color Rich Brown. The only liner that I own and I love it. I feel like I wanna go lighter on the liner today. What lip to do, what lip to do? I think Praline, NYX Butter Gloss in the color Praline. And then Fenty Beauty and Hot Chocolate on top, likely. Fenty Beauty chocolate it also smells phenomenal okay i think that's it actually you know i might do some brow flick um, also from kosas i don't know if this actually does anything i'd like to pretend that it does though okay fill in those brows girl we're gonna pretend like that did something. Anyways, the bride is resting right now before we go to the cocktail hour, cocktail party, as she should. Get that beauty rest, girl. You have a big day tomorrow. Um, and I'll show you my outfit next. Final outfit details for the evening. My earrings, they, girl, I actually got these in the airport in Lisbon. They're like Parafois, P-A-R-A-F-O-I-S. I could be saying that wrong. Um, and they were $8.99, so slay. And then this dress is from Cos. Can you see the full thing? My heels, they are Sam Edelman. What a close up that is. Free toes. <laughs> um, and my bag is from YSL, but that's the outfit for the evening. See you later. Hi, good morning. Um, another lovely morning. Are you joking? I don't know if you can see that. Let's try this side. Even worse. Um, so it's wedding day, it's coronation day. But I am the first one to get my makeup done at 7.30, so I'm going to go on a walk at lovely 6 a.m.
and that's about it i don't know what i'm gonna do until 3 p.m after i get my makeup done uh, but i have some time to kill so we'll see that's what i'm wearing lululemon lululemon apl sneaks and i'm just gonna have a lovely stroll maybe a jog we'll see i'll talk to you later It's so fun. And Tatum's the best. Stands, but I promise you it will never be their last. So you two can go ahead and find your seats up at your head table. Oh, yeah. 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 I'm so excited for dinner. Hi guys, good morning, happy Sunday, post-wedding day, the wedding was fabulous, no notes, 10 out of 10, congrats to Riley and Parker. Um, today I'm off to Malibu, I'm so excited to see my family this week and celebrate my sister's birthday, my birthday as well as on Wednesday, but really it's for her 30th, um, so excited to do that for her, but not much going on today, I'm just gonna do a quick backyard workout, shower, get ready for the airport, and then just kind of chill when I get to Malibu. If I'm close to a beach, maybe I'll go hang out at the beach. I don't even know what the temperature is there right now. I just know it's so nice in Arizona. Let's see what it's looking like. Oh, maybe not. It's 55, so I'm just going to be inside all day and hang out. I'm usually not that big of a California person in terms of living because it's not as walkable as I want it to be, but driving here, I might be a California person. I don't know. I don't know. The beach really does something in the warm weather. Maybe just because I haven't been in warm weather for so long or by the beach. But anyways, let's get to the tour. I'm going to start with outside because the view is phenomenal and it's just so gorgeous out. So here we are. And some patio furniture as well. We go back inside, kitchen to the left. We will not be doing that much cooking. And then the family room. But this is actually the whole room because it's one floor. I love the big windows. And then to the left over here is one of the bedrooms in the bathroom. Perfect, Diana, you're flying through this. My bad, I'll slow down. This is the bathroom, shower. Hi. Um, and then if we go back this way to the other bedroom. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Look 
There's also a half bath here. So just the toilet and then this bedroom. And then it has the bath as well. My favorite part though is for sure the outside patio. So I will be there hanging for the day, getting some sun, eating a very late lunch, deciding what to do for dinner, figuring out groceries, um, and doing a whole bunch of other random things.